So I found out today that uh, Justin Trudeau came out and called people racists that don't take a J-A-B. That is psychoticness on his part. He's showing his psychopathy. It has nothing to do with being racist. Oh my God, I can't look at those little girl freaking shoulders. Okay, we'll put his head back down there. But anyway, yeah, it has nothing to do with being racist. And nobody could be more racist than the Trudeaus. You had, uh, what, two generations that knew Native kids were being slaughtered, murdered in these creepy schools that were supposed to be good for them. Yeah. Hmm. He couldn't even say anything decent other than, you already knew. They called them liars when they said they had witnessed their buddies being murdered. So then he called them misogynist. Hate women. Hey, hate women. No, not one person that decided they didn't want to be part of the global experiment that was a man. Hated women that I've come across. You're delusional. You're making things up. Let's get past his little girly arms. So this is by Rex. Rex Murphy. never was right. Thank you, Rex. Thank you. You're the only news I didn't really resent and find fake and find anything wrong with it, but I haven't gone through it yet. Okay, so it's never right for a leader to launch a vicious, vicious invective against an entire subset of citizens. It's Nazism, I know. I'm half Jewish German. I got a Jewish German last name. And then I'm Ukrainian on the other side. In fact, there's only 32 people that with my Ukrainian mother's last name in the world left after their uh, engineered food shortage in the USSR. My grandma and grandpa escaped with a couple of kids and they came here and had more kids. So that's how I came into existence. Angry. He's such an angry little girl. Anti-vaxxers. First of all, my dog's all vaxxed up. I would never be downtown East End where Trudeau's poopy pee neighborhood, the worst in Canada, while he's yelling at people partying that are double jabbed, triple jabbed on an airplane. Are you kidding me? Yelling at them, telling them, oh, you know, the jab didn't work, so you guys should have been doing everything. Is that what you're telling me? I mean, they should have been free. There's nothing righteous about a Luciferian Justin Trudeau. I think he comes from a long line of Luciferian freaking names. Just check out his mother's last name. That's pretty interesting. A little bit of, what, Mystery Babylon, Mystery Religion. We all know Mystery Religions are Luciferian. Just about. Yeah, it makes them, you know, big unsightly lumps on their back of their heads. Use kittens as door stops and gas. Don't recycle. Should we tolerate them? This is total Nazi propaganda. It's how it started. So that they could make a group of people enemies. And it wasn't just Jewish people. It was babies that weren't born perfectly. It was people in the mental hospital. It was a lot of people they called useless eaters. Follow the train of thought. There may be a fringe group. Oh, boy. Well, you know that fringe group just hasn't fell down and worshipped the propaganda coming off the crappy Canadian news. I'm not a bastard. I find there's something really wrong with people that would leave out two or three billion people out of almost eight billion people because almost half people or more won't get the J-A-B. Definitely a quarter and you would leave two billion, hundreds and hundreds of million people out. I don't want to be like that per person. And if that is the average J-A-B person, I do not want to be like them. I'd rather die. I'd rather have my government cut my head off then, you know, bow down to that kind of evilness. 
Like I'm not smart, Trudeau, to do research. Oh my God, you hired a bunch of IQ challenge freaking scientists and you won't present them on TV because probably if we took a look at them, their IQ challengeness would show up right away. Because quite frankly, I've been six months. I'm always ahead of your news. Always ahead. So I'm smarter than all your broadcasters or number two, all your broadcasters are lying evil bastards. Scapegoating. Well, I don't get scapegoated down here because you just have to look out my freaking window. See my window with the view. I get scapegoated for not being on fucking crack, heroin, jib, and whatever else. Oh, yeah, they got side. So when you go up and down the block, they go up, down, side. So you can get three different kind of drugs from them. The only good thing about fentanyl is perfect for uh, putting on a tip of arrow if you were hunting, you know? That would be great. Because it's hard to get a gun, right? And you might have to feed yourself. But the animals were infected on the other side of Canada with some weirdism, so you might not even want to be able to eat the animals. I wouldn't doubt it if the animals become infected with this uh, disease that uh, the spike proteins fold on them, their proteins fold on them, and then it's like a rabies, and, and people are getting it too. They don't know where it's coming from because the scientists, well, you know, IQ challenged in Canada, made a lot of, I wish I knew the name, but I can't. If I'm already on joint number three. Over, it, done their duty. You know, I've been to the uh, CDC to look at the injuries, and quite frankly, holy crap, over a million. Over a million got injured doing their duty. Uh, they always hate it here. Do you know Trudeau's idiotic dead daddy gave all British Columbia the finger? Then I knew he was a piece of shit, and I was alive for that. You know, I didn't have a problem with the Trudeau, when, except for he gave me a fucking finger. And he was ugly. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I may not be good looking, but I'm 60 years old now. And I had my cute days maybe over, but I don't give a damn. I wasn't ugly. And in power. Not paying off the people that got MK Ultra mind control tortured in our psych wards. Unsuspecting Canadians. Plus the dead children. I'll never get over that. The anger that comes over me when I think of the Catholics, which those little fuckers, they baptized me, so I have to do something about that. I've been wanting to do it all my life. But nowadays, I can't even get a hold of the Catholic people without doing a whole bunch of swear words. So it's like my swearing Tourette's comes out with my post-traumatic stress, you know, of Satanic Paul's Hospital. So, yeah, i got a lot of issues. I laugh at people that tell me I've got issues. Everyone's got fucking issues. We're in a fucking crazy upside down world. Just, I gotta tell you, my heart is slowing down reading this. Yeah, barring flights from China was racist. We had to get the flu. That was a fucking lie. I can tell when these people lie. I came back from hell, the dark side, and I can smell evil. Yeah, from China. I have a bunch of masks I got to go through that are on the list of the Canadian government for having graphene particles in them. And they're going to hurt you and hurt your lungs. Black Lives Matter. See, you knew Black Lives Matter was a psyop. You know, to make, first of all, racism and keep the virus going. Who does a... Black Lives Matter protests. I mean, I'm so ashamed of those people that came up with that, you know, knowing that my native friend who passed away, Bob Coots, witnessed children being murdered on the island. I had to go every day on the comment section, just about every day, saying, find the bodies on the island. And they did, hundreds of them. I'm sorry he didn't live to see that. 
should have been children. Oh, now we have child's lives matter. And that's not true because if they did, they would go listen to my video about the WHO guy talking. I'm not going to say it. Let it come out of his words, YouTube, so I don't have to get a strike. Yeah, who gets to call us racist? Who gets to call me as a German Jewish person, you know, with 350 names, less than 350 names left in the world with my name on, with 8 billion people? And who the hell gets to call me a racist when the other part of me, there's less than 33? Maybe less, because my mom died. Because of the communism and the U. Uh, SSR in the Ukraine. Who? Why do you get to call me a racist, Trudeau? I know you're a racist, misogynist. You hate me. I have less rights than a transgender, my transgender buddy. And then you took my transgender buddy's right to meet any other god other than your transgender baphomet. You know, that pisses me off too. I know that. You made my transgender friend have less spiritual and religious rights. Giving someone five years in jail and calling it whatever. I can't remember the word. It was so ridiculous. They're looking for help not to be in that kind of lifestyle. They're highly suicidal. They have most rights in the world or in Canada of anybody, including women. No rapist goes to jail for five years. You're misogynist. Oh, his father had uh, glory? I didn't know that. I didn't believe so. I think you're wrong on that. It's turned into a tissue. No, it's turned into a pile of poop. Come on. Say it as it is, Rex. I expect more of you. Ah. Oh. Villain of the moment. I can't help but hating him. I can't. 